welcome back to a video today i'm going to teach you how to build a super efficient melon farm slash pumpkin farm in your minecraft world all you need to do is uh all you get all this stuff it works in minecraft 1.11 also works in minecraft 1.12 uh, because it uses observers so you need to play use it in minecraft 11 plus minecraft 1.11 plus so Without further ado, let's get straight into it. How to build this awesome melon farm. Okay, first off, all you need is a redstone torch, hopper, power drill, rail, and a minecraft hopper. Now, we first we're gonna build the collection system because it's underground. So we're gonna build the collection system first. Then we're gonna build all the farm stuff and all the redstone stuff. Let's get straight into it. So first of all, you need to uh, choose an output hopper this will be your output uh, this will be your output okay I should and you should take it out and take it like this and fill this entire thing with hoppers so you can uh, put and after that we'll put some minecart with hoppers on it so we can we can take away items from under the blocks which items fall so if our items fall on this the minecraft hoppers down below will collect all the melons so you can collect them in chest so you can use them for easy use okay next we need to do is uh, get one hopper over here this is just a uh, uh, and hopper we're gonna use right now and later we're gonna remove it okay we're gonna put two rails all around then powered rails all around like that then power rails all around like that okay then what you need to do is take a redstone torch, place one over here, and take a redstone torch and place one over here. Uh, now to set up your minecart with hopper, all you need to do is put this rail down uh, and then put your minecart with hopper and we'll start running all around. Uh, you didn't need that hopper. I don't know why I did that say that. Well, this is done. And whenever an item drops, let's say uh, the sandstone block. Can you drop sandstone? Okay, so the sandstone drop. Oh, yeah, it's picked up by the hoppers whenever the it pops up, and it will be collected in this final chest. Okay, so now we can start building the farm. Okay, now that all's done, uh, what you need to do is take dirt blocks, place one over here, then go all around, however you want it. Make sure it's less than. Uh, 14 blocks otherwise uh, that could be from redstone signal problems uh, later I'll tell you how to connect two units this uh, design is stackable uh, and later I'll tell you how to uh, stack two units together so you can use them but if you want to build the redstone again and again it's okay if you want to build it after you place it in the dirt all you need to do is take the farmland and put it all around here over here okay um, and also Speaking of it, you need a water source block over here. Otherwise, it will not work. I'm just using ice for now because ice, I love it. Okay, you know what? I'll just use a water bucket. I don't care. It's okay. It's okay. Um, so, you need a water source over there, water source over there. Uh, make sure you make sure your formula is tilled and this should be all done. Let's get into the building stuff. Okay, so first of all, only is take the observer. You need to put it all around like here. So all the observers will be the face of the observers will be facing over here, so that they can observe any beauty updates over here that is going on over here. Then you need blocks over here, um, blocks all around like that. Perfect. Okay. Then you need to go down over here and you need to place in all the pistons. Make sure the player make sure they're facing all like that, otherwise it wouldn't work. Make sure the okay. Make sure they are all placed like that. No, not like that. Okay, wait. We'll just remove the dirt for a second so we can place in all the oh, no, 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 oh my god i just broke it 
Good job. Okay, after I've done all of this, I will come back. Okay. Really unprofessional, guys. So, guys, everything is now fixed. Uh, I have fixed everything. Uh, that was my mistake. Okay. Uh, don't blame me. Uh, no, do blame me. Not my machine's fault. Okay. So, now on to the redstone part. Now, we need to put some redstone dust all around over here. So, all whenever there's a beauty update, whenever a melon grows, uh, this machine will find out. It will detect that there is a block that is grown over here. Yes, okay. Now, uh, now once I've uh, done all of this, all you need is uh, some repeater, uh, a block, a uh, block. You need a repeater, you need a block, you need a sticky piston, uh, you need a restaurant torch, and yeah, okay. Now let's get into building this thing. Okay, now on to the restaurant part. For the restaurant part, what you need to do is take a repeater output from this end over here, or that end for that matter. Uh, then you need to place three restaurant dust over here. Then you need to take a repeater output from over here. No, 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 no. Uh, you need to just Take a normal output from there. Uh, then you need to take a repeater output from here, then to this block over here, and a redstone torch over here. Make sure you set this to three ticks, otherwise, this won't work. I mean, you can keep it to four ticks too, but it will just make the designs uh, slower. Then you need to take a sticky piston over here and place any solid block over here. Then you need to take a repeater output again from here. Then you need to build a staircase so it can go all the way around and place redstone dust over here. And that's it. That's all redstone done. Now all you need to do is place in your melon seeds and then bone meal them or just wait for them to grow. And then once they produce any melons, uh, let me get some melons. Let me get some melons. The design will break it. And they will be collected by the minecarver hopper and they will be collected over here. Perfect. Now, now for connecting designs. Now, if you don't, just don't want to build this redstone all over again and again, all you need to do is place a block over here. Then you can take a repeater and place one over here and one over here. That's it. That's it. You don't need any of this redstone now. Uh, now the only problem is if one of this fires, all of these will fire, and that can quite cause quite a bit of lag. So I would prefer you to make uh, separated. But if you have a good computer and if you're not staying much, if you're not using this much, like melons are not that useful in Minecraft, melons and pumpkins, uh, like. But still, you want to farm a little bit of them then this can be your thing so guys i think that is pretty much it for this video make sure you hit that like and subscribe button down below for more of these kind of redstone videos and that is yeah gaming signing out and i'll see you next time bye bye